Oh, hello, I didn't see you there. I've got a story to tell you, and it happened a long, long time ago in a place called This story is about a man named Ebenezer Scrooge. Hello, my name is Ebenezer Scrooge, but you can call me Mr. Scrooge for short. Money is my best friend. He was counting his money when his employee Bob came in and asked, Um, excuse me, sir, can I have Christmas off? Uh, why should I do that? Because it's Christmas. I'll give you half a day, but you're going to have to take it out of your pay. Okay, thank you, sir. After work, Ebenezer decided to go home. So he got ready for bed and sat down next to a chair by the fireplace. Then he heard all these bells, and it felt like the wind was coming in through the window into his room. All of a sudden, he heard these sounds. <laughs> All of a sudden, out of nowhere, the ghost pops up. <laughs> he gets very scared. Whoa, who are you? I'm your old partner, Jacob Marley. Don't you remember me? Wait, you're Marley? Yeah, um, but how do I know you're real? Excuse me? Okay, okay, you're real, okay, you're real. But, why are you here? I'm here to warn you that if you don't change your ways, your chains will be heavier than mine. Well, what should I do? You will be visited by three ghosts, and you need to listen to what they say, okay? Okay, but what if I don't want to? Well, too bad, you're going to. Bye! <laughs> Wait, don't leave me! Uh, too late. Well, I think I'll go to bed. Um, hello? Excuse me. Ebenezer, wake up! Wake up, wake up, wake up! Wake up! Okay, 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 I'm up, I'm up. Uh, I am the first ghost that you're going to be visited by. One out of three. It's a fraction. So, what are you here to show me? I am your ghost of Christmas past. Uh, and I'm going to show you some stuff on uh, your past that happened during Christmas time. So go on, let's go. Hey, that's me when I was a kid. Yeah, you were left at school during Christmas. Oh yeah, I didn't like that. Yeah, well, I'm sure other people don't like that either. Yeah, probably. Come on, let's go look at something else. This is boring. Hey, that's me when I was working. Uh-huh. I was having a Christmas party with my old boss. That was so much fun. Yeah, you could do that at your work. Uh, no, that would be too hard. Besides, I don't care about what the people do for Christmas. All I care about is my money. That's nice. Okay. Whoa, 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 man. <sighs> Must have just been a bad dream. Oh, well, I'll just go back to bed. Oh, 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 Santa Claus, is that you? No, it's just me, the ghost of Christmas present. Mm. Wait, does that mean I get presents? No, present, not presents. Sorry, I'm not actually Santa Claus. Well, let's go look at your stuff that's happening today around Christmas time. Mm, okay. Hey, that's my nephew Fred's house. Yeah, and they're having a Christmas party. Yeah, I was invited to that, but I thought money was more important than going to some dumb Christmas party, you know. Eh, I think you would have had fun. Yeah, well, I'm never going to go, no matter how many times he just keeps inviting me. Oh, well, your choice. All right, let's go look at something else. Where are we at? Oh, this is Bob's house. Your employee. Oh, that's cool. Who's that tiny kid? Oh, that's Tiny Tim, his son. Oh man, he's tiny. He looks so happy. I know, people have fun on Christmas. How can they be so happy when they barely got anything to eat on that table? Well, it's just Christmas joy. Too bad they don't have a boss that pays enough for them to get a big turkey, though. Then they'd be way happier. Oh wait, you're his boss. Never mind. Well, uh, see you later. <laughs> Whoa, was that another same one of those dreams? That means there's probably one more coming. Maybe this is actually true. Eh, whatever. <laughs> 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 
What? What? Wait, what? Are you the third ghost? Oh, okay. Um. Oh, you want me to touch your finger so we can go somewhere? Hey, look, we're at Bob's house again. Is this in the Christmas future? Oh, it is? I lost school. Hey, where's the little tiny Tim guy? This can't be true, can it? He can't die. He's so little. Is this the way that it has to be? Or is there something we can do to change it? Oh, you want me to touch your finger again? Where are we? Oh, we're in the cemetery. Wow. Why are you showing me this? Oh, whose tombstone is that? Let me take a closer look. Oh, wait, that's mine? No, it can't be that. Look, there's a hole in the ground. Ah! Save it! Oh! Oh, just in bed. Whew. Whoa, I'm still alive. Hey, look, it's morning. Hey, you out there! Yeah? What day is it? It's Christmas Day! Oh, it's Christmas morning. It's not too late. I can change. I'm going to be a better person. Hey, boy out there. Yeah? Go buy me the biggest, fattest, juiciest turkey you can find and send it to Bob's house. Here's the money. Okay. Yay! I feel like a little kid again. I feel happy. Woo! I'm going to go scare Bob. Ha ah! ha How come you're not at work? But you said, I'm going to fire you. Just kidding. Merry Christmas! Did you get your turkey? Oh, that was from you? Yeah. Did it taste good? Mm hmm? It was good. Where's Tiny Tim? Oh, he's in his bedroom. I'll go get him. Hi, Tim. I'm Mr. Scrooge, and I'm going to hire some doctors to help you walk again. Merry Christmas. This is the best Christmas ever. God bless us, everyone. Well, that's all. I hope you enjoyed the story. Have a, have a very Merry Christmas and Happy New Year.